Welcome world, it's Mills Young here, part of Pick Dogs, and it's a wonderful Tuesday, and you know what we're doing here, we're shopping for props, player props, that's what we do here at Pick Dogs, we look at all the player props on the sports market, and try to put some money in your pocket, alright, now look man, now this is how I come up with this uh, little program and show for us on the shopping list here now, you know, so I think it's like our fourth week now, you know, we've been getting some solid runs, a lot of plus money uh, wins, you know, we don't win all the days, you know, out of five props, a lot of times, you know, sometimes we go three and two, other ones, you know, we go 50-50, other ones we go four and one, some days we get five and no. Oh. But look, man, if you guys like these type of props, man, they're hitting at 60% clips and 80% clips, and warm references in this is all on the betting tools. It's free, so use it. Don't abuse it. Don't lose it. All right, now let's go, man. Let's get it on. Let's. What are we talking about? Let's talk about yesterday, man. We went three and two. We were so close to sweeping the board. I mean, so close. I mean, we had Austin Revis over 17 and a half points. He had 17. We had Jamal Murray over 25 and a half points. Remember that last shot, little layup. He misses. We would have hit it. He would have made it. We would have won. 5-0. and oh. Besides that, we swept the board, though. All right. Ain't about yesterday. It's about today. How we're going to get paid. So let me know your top play in the comment. Let me know the prop that you're shopping for today so we can get paid in the chat. All right. Let's head on over to the association. Man, this game's going to be crazy. Another elimination game going on. Miami Heat trying to put out the Boston Celtics. Player prop number one. Give me Caleb Martin, over 11.5 points, hit out a 60% clip. Three out of his last five games, he hit this. Shooting 41% from the three-point uh, in the postseason. Stats and facts that I like. 18 points in his last game, 25 in the other, 15, 8, and 11. He's one of those guys that's just on the court getting points and ain't nobody accounting for. So let's go ahead and take Caleb Martin over 11.5 points. Uh, that's player prop number one. Player prop number two. Give me Marcus Smart, over 22 and a half points, rebounds, and assists. He had a 60% clip. All right, man. Three out of his last five games, he did this too. Uh, last game, gave us 8, 9, and 8. Game 1, he gave us 13, 11, and 1. Two games out the series, he hit. One game, he just didn't. I know one thing. He ain't going out like that. I ain't saying that he's going to get 25 points. I ain't saying that he's going to get 12 rebounds. I ain't saying that he's going to get 10 assists. I'm just saying, he's going to go over 22 and a half Points, rebounds, and assists. Mixing them all. Marcus Smart is one of those guys. If he can't score, he's going to beat up the boards and get you a gang of assists. If the assists ain't dropping and the rebounds ain't going, he probably got about 22 points. So that's what I'm going to be going on that one. That's player prop number two. Player prop number three. Give me Jason Tatum to record a double-double. The reason why I'm doing this is rebound props at 10 and a half. I was thinking about taking that. Still might. But, you know, the, the, the recorded double-double is just kind of a given. He's been grabbing those nine and a half rebounds pretty much every single game in this series except for one. So, you know, I think he's going to get 10 points. Right, folks? Yeah. So we're going to go ahead and take Jason Tatum to record a double-double. Hitting at a 60% clip. The betting tools are in line. That's player prop number three. Player prop number four. Give me Jimmy Butler, over seven and a half rebounds, hitting at a 60% clip tool. Uh, you know, last game he gave us eight, but he's just one of those guys to where I remember. Spolster told him last year in one of the games, he said, hey, man, I don't care about you giving me uh, 28 points. I need you to give me seven rebounds every game. So that's like a thing that Spolster has with Jimmy Butler to where he has to give him seven rebounds every game. In this game... You got to give me eight, all right? So, uh, yeah, that's the that's the player prop we on. Jimmy Butler, over seven and a half uh, rebounds. Player prop number five. Let's head on over to the diamond, the baseball diamond. Well, what better game to talk about? I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Atlanta Braves versus the Los Angeles Dodgers. I mean, the Dodgers got game one yesterday, you know. Game two is taking place today. Who are we looking at? Spencer Strider, over 8.5 Ks, hitting at a 60% clip. He's number one in strikeouts, folks. 86 Ks on the year, 4-1 uh, record, 2.96 ERA, 1.01. We it? All right, man. Last game, though, I knew something wasn't right because everybody I knew was on his K prop, including me. And it's just some of these things, man. When everybody's on it in the same one, I feel a certain way, but not today. Last game, he gave us seven. Game four, that he gave us 12, 10, 8, and 13. So we're going to be taking Spencer Strider over eight and a half.
half Ks, okay? Those are the player props that we're going to be betting on today. Now, let me know your guys' best props, your best bets, and, you know, your best parlays. Let me know what you guys cashed yesterday, what you're shopping for today. Now, look, man, betting on sports, I need help. Can't do it by myself. So check us out at Pick Dogs, man. We got the best handicappers, the best premium picks, and free videos daily. Best betting community. You can't go wrong. Daily videos, like, every two hours. Literally. All right. So this is Mills Young here. Part of Pick Dogs. See you guys same time, same channel. If you can't roll with the Pick Dogs, stay on the porch. Oh.